Greetings, I'm Geo Fatboy. I make shaving videos and sell shaving supplies. Visit ShaveNation.com for all your shaving needs. Have a great shave, have a great day. Greetings, gents and ladies. I'm Geo Fatboy for ShaveNation.com. You've been on lockdown for what now? Three, four weeks? Probably going a little bit crazy. How about I cheer you up a little bit? I did this once before at the turn of the century. Not really, what was it, 2019 into 2020? And it was pretty interesting, it was a lot of fun, so I felt like now's a good time to break it out and do it again. Geo Fatboy responds to viewers' comments. I've got a few pages here, let's get through these real quick. Elemental Hero Joe says, if he doesn't clear the runways, he's not the real Geo Fatboy. I'll put a link to that up there, that video. That's when somebody was trying to impersonate me. You can check that out. James Geo says, this guy is the dad we all deserve. Thank you, James. I'm happy to fill in. The original Italian shave. This is from Samuel G. from the United States. He says, this makes me feel like I just left Grosso's Barbershop in the Park Sheridan back in 1957. All without the gunshots. Park Sheridan, that's Chicago, by the way. Ben won. I'm 71 years old. In 1964, I went to the World's Fair held in Queens, New York. General Motors had an exhibit called Futurama, like the TV show. One of the predictions made was that we would have flying cars by the year 2000. I thought we would, didn't you? I thought we would have had that by now. No mention was made about personal computers, cell phones, or the internet. One never knows what the future holds in store for us. Thank you, Ben. I love 71 years old. He's got the words of wisdom from an elderly gentleman. Love that stuff. And by the way, uh, you know, what's happening in the world right now, our lockdown and all that, all the soothsayers and fortune tellers in the world, nobody could predict this. Come on, people. What's up? That's all I'll say. Gutworm685. Another excellent video. I would love to try using a cutthroat razor but they're a bit expensive and high maintenance for me. Kind of like a wife. <laughs> Love it. That's great, no comment. Laz N commented, my dad should have taught me this. Geo is my dad. Thanks Laz, I'm happy to fill in. Carl Hungus, he's got a few here. He commented, I've watched so many of Geo's videos, he's like family. Thanks Uncle Geo. Thank you. Carl Hungus again, he says, Geo's videos are more relaxing than booze and safer than medication. Nice. Taker replied, Geo Fatboy, you taught me how to shave, now you taught me how to cut my hair. I'll put a link to that video, how to cut your hair with clippers by yourself. Simon Osborne, he said, it really scares me when you talk and cut at the same time. By the way, I use one of those, the Kamasori style. He's talking about the Feather Artist Club. Camasori style razor. I'll put a link to that video as well. You can check it out. The Feather AC and my Edwin Jagger DE89 are my favorite and most used shaving irons. Nicely put. Shaving irons. I like that. Hawkeye is my buddy. Hawkeye of the eye. Hello, Geo, and thanks for the video. I only have one observation and one, maybe two questions. I have watched, I believe, all of your videos, and I have not once seen a drop of blood come from that baby's hiney smooth shave. Can I attribute that to a fantastic, beautiful editing job? Or are you just that darn good? God bless you, my friend. Best regards to you, Hawkeye. Thanks, Hawkeye. All the best to you as well. Only my hairdresser knows for sure. Starlo Deer says, again, about this Feather Artist Club stainless steel razor. Naming it Club SS, is a bit insensitive towards Germans. Solid Hesco says, the only reason Chuck Norris has a beard is because Geo Fatboy hasn't taught him how to shave yet. Keep the videos coming and stay awesome. Thanks, Solid. Damage Inc. says, love the bandana. Do you think anyone wants a roundhouse kick to the face while he's wearing that bad boy? That's a little Napoleon Dynamite reference there. Gotta love that. Adi Meta says, Totally badass. Love your videos. It has changed my life and inspired me to take pride in shaving. You're a man's man. Keep up the good work. Thank you, Adi. I'll do my best. Jason Williams. Did he play for the Cubs or the Bulls? I think he played for the Bulls. Jason Williams. What did I do on my day off? 
Oh, nothing much. Just watched like 30 videos of this guy shaving. Thank you for your time, Jason. Floofy Town 10. He says, from Chicago, looks Italian AF, uses Parasso. This dude has used a Tommy gun. <laughs> I take the fifth on that one. John B says, Gio reminds me of a younger, skinnier Tony Soprano. Nice. Maybe when the series first started, he was thin, but as it went on, he was living the life. He put on a couple pounds. I don't know who this one's from, but it says, great video, nice and relaxed. One more quote, and I think everyone will know where it's from. And it made for some hilarious comments. Knob out. That refers to my video on the Razorine razor. Speaking of the knob out when you shave with it. I'll put a link. You can check that out as well. Razorine. Oh, one more from Carl Hungus. Tony Soprano would approve of this video. R.I.P. James Gandolfini. I agree. From my video, Top 10 Reasons to Shave with a Straight Razor. I'll put that link up there as well. Paul Harlock. This is the best YouTube video I have watched in years. I feel great. Thanks. <laughs> Happy to help. Aussie Bloke Gordo said, That thing was forged in the fires of Mount Doom. He is referring to my Spartacus straight razor. Possibly one of the most beautiful straight razors ever made. Here's a look at it. And I think he's right. Forged in the fires of Mount Doom. I always think of Tom Cruise in the movie uh, The Color of Money, where he goes, dude asks him, he goes, what you got in the box? He opens it up, little smile, he goes, doom. <laughs> Classic. Love it. Anyway, that's a look at the Spartacus. I'll put a link. You can check out me shaving with this razor. Jeff Robinson said, thank you, Gio, for getting me into DE shaving. You have opened my eyes, and I'll never go back to the other way. I'm still training my ninja moves on the 34C, as per your recommendation, and strive to become a DE samurai like yourself in time. You'll get there, Jeff. Practice makes perfect, and muscle memory is your friend. On my video, What Your Daddy Didn't Tell You About Shaving, SVT Lycee Imzorin says, All men on this planet should listen to this man. <laughs> I don't know about that. But thank you for that. This one's from 20UK. 20UK, yep. Geo, I've been watching... I love this one. Geo, I've been watching your vids for years from the UK. Sorry to see you've been demoted from the Swish bathroom to what appears to be a dungeon. <laughs> All you need is a couple of manacles hanging on the wall and Vincent Price holding your towel <laughs> to complete the scene. Best wishes from England. What? What's wrong with my bathroom? You don't like it? <laughs> It's classic. And what a beautiful picture he painted with words. I love that. This guy must be a writer. I would think he's a writer. All right, here we go. Last but not least. I'm going to use initials on this one because I don't want to shame anybody. Here we go. PG says, Hi, Geo. Could you do a review of the Mula Hexagon Forest Safety Razor? I recently bought one from Amazon. Would just like your opinion and your thoughts. Thanks. C38 replied, Maybe next time you should buy from Geo and ask Amazon about their opinion. Dropping the mic right here. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks very much for watching. Visit ShaveNation.com for all your shaving supplies. I'm Geo Fatboy. Have a great shave. Have a great day. I'm out. Uh-oh. Looks like I have a 4 o'clock shadow. Gotta go to ShaveNation.com. Have a great shape, have a great day.